Morning guys, so it's the next day and we had a really good time celebrating Paul's birthday last night. I didn't end up vlogging very much so I don't really know what yesterday's vlog is going to look like. Um, I was more concerned of just having a good time with Paul other than filming stuff. Um, the weather's not as good today as it was yesterday and we're currently heading um, to Paul's grandparents because his mum's organised like a family kind of photo portrait session for everyone so we're going to do that this afternoon. And then later on we are heading up to the north of Holland because tomorrow we're going to go see all of the tulip fields because I've managed to come like the perfect time to go and see all of the tulips so we're going to head up there tonight so that tomorrow we can just go there and be chilled in the morning so yeah we're just walking to where we're going to get the photos taken now but it's so sunny the lighting in this mirror. I need one like this in my house. It's findable. Bring your close up. Go. Go. Oh, it's a bubble machine. New best friend, I'm going to get all my photos taken with this one. Yeah. <laughs> to lunch with Paul's Oma and Opa and his brother. What? <laughs> it looks completely weirded out by the fact that I'm talking to myself to the camera in the back of the car. Oh, I'm used to you yeah. doing it. Yeah, I know. So how did you like the photo shoot? No, yeah, it was cool. Yeah? It's you had nice. fun? Yeah. It was something different. I hope your mum liked it. I think we got some really nice pictures of, of everyone, so it was good. Are you hungry? Yes. Ready for lunch? Let's go eat. So I've been to this place a few times already with Paul's Oma and Opa for lunch. It's really, really pretty. It's a very nice place to sit outside, so with the weather as good as it is today, it's good. I love your Oma and Opa. They're so cute. You don't want to be in it. It's like hovering behind the camera. Oh, see, she's turning. I'm not going to get run over. So how hungry are you on a scale of one to a million? Millions and millions and millions. I haven't right. eaten for 20 hours. Oh no. Right. 
Let's get so. some food in this one. So we just came home really quickly to grab our bags and I changed because it is so hot today. Like I didn't think that Holland could get this hot in April but apparently yes it's like 20 degrees or something and sunny and I was in jeans so the whole way through lunch I was sweating so just got changed. Now we're going to get in the car and drive up to the north of Holland and hopefully the weather's still good because the weather's been really strange today. It's like sunny and then cloudy and now it's even raining but it's still sunny. Um, could drive off Scotland for unpredictability. Um, but we're going to get in the car, drive up and there's supposed to be a really nice beach up there so we're going to go for a walk on the beach hopefully tonight when we get there. I didn't know what Paul had booked, but it's actually really pretty. We're really quite cool. close to the tulip fields, but we have a really nice view from this little balcony. It's like a little lake. It's <laughs> musical. Mm -hmm. You like it? Yes. Yeah. Yes. Yeah. Okay. Let's go to the beach! Where are you going? This way? It's the ocean. It smells like the seaside in the UK. It doesn't smell like a like a, a nice seaside. It doesn't smell like the beach, it smells like the seaside. That's it. It smells like fish and chips and and grease and seawater. And it's a little bit windy, so it's a little bit cold. Are the Dutch reclaiming more land from the sea? <laughs> oh wow, it's like it's like a pier. This is so cute. Can we walk down? I thought you wanted to There's walk like up a carousel here. and everything. <laughs> because otherwise you would just like uh, do it all evening. Yeah. So many people here. It's well it's I suppose this is a very nice day for Holland, so especially on Sunday. It's really cute. It's kind of like the UK piers that you get, like Brighton and, and Blackpool, even though I've never been to either of them. Do you want to I've seen pictures, no. I'm okay. <laughs> you can get your caricature done. We already did that in Tenerife. Where is that? Here. No, the caricature that we already got now. It's in my home. There's a carousel and everything. What's this thing holding? It looks very old and pretty. This is not what I was expecting at all. 
we expect them to be tackled on the beach. Ah! Oh, oh, you're falling ah! over. Falling over, you're falling over. What are you doing? Baby. <laughs> the whole world can see my knickers. Oh. I used it on my foot. All of England. Just chilling. Just chilling. When was the last time you came to the beach in Holland? Long time ago. You can smell weed. Okay. Mm. Well, I suppose it is a Dutch beach. Yeah. So across that horizon is the UK. Um. Yeah. This is the closest I've been to home for months. <laughs> it's kind of true, though. for a little bit, maybe wander around, find something to eat, and head back to the It's been a nice day, hasn't it? It's been a different day. We'll just share a nice lunch with your grandparents. the right way like they are just like jumping in I would not be swimming in this water they're insane I mean one thing is they've got very color coordinated because their little swim shorts match the pillars behind them I will follow him and follow him wherever he may go there is in an, what is it an ocean so deep or shells too sharp that will keep keep me away. Oh, that hurts. Oh. Come on. I'm pretty sure I'm very scared that this is gonna be blowing up. Calm Not down, like, calm like down, Murray Poppins. It's not gonna blow up. <laughs> not in Syria here. What, what did Mary. <laughs> oh. Grew pineapples on the beach here in Holland. Look, pineapple. It's a pineapple plantation. Just terrible joke. <laughs> 